Welcome to the Golf Spotlight. I'm Ralph Irvin here in the Golf Shop Studio, and today we are talking about playing golf in 2021, and that essentially means walking more than in recent memory. For most, that means a push cart or a trolley, and today we are talking to one of the industry leaders. But before we get into the trolley technology, I ask you to click on the red subscribe button and turn on your notifications so you never miss an episode of the Golf Spotlight. And comment down below, do you ride or walk? Or do you usually use a caddy, pull cart, push cart, or do you carry? Let us know. But now, let's get to these carts as we are joined by Click Gear USA National Sales Manager, Todd Hansen. Todd, thanks for joining us. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for having me, Ralph. I appreciate it. I've used other brands of carts and I've used ones from Click Gear. What I want to know is what is it that makes Click Gear carts move so easily on the grass? We have um, oversized ball bearings that are sealed in every wheel that help the cart roll smooth. And, and roll smooth for a long period of time as, as they won't rust over, they won't freeze up because they're encased. I think also if you look at our tire design, um, the tires are, are flat design with minimal tread, so you don't get a lot of vibration up the handle if you're on a paved surface, a, a cart path or something like that. I think it's a combination of those two things in terms of why it is so smooth and why it rolls so nicely and why it feels so effortlessly to push. Everything's well balanced. You know, you have your back wheels and your front wheel in the right place. So everything is balanced. You're not going to be fighting things, tipping over. Maybe that's part of it too. 2020 was a record year across the world of golf. A lot of rounds played and the increased amount in walking meant a record interest and demand for click gear carts. Absolutely. It was incredible. All things considered, we feel really good about what we were able to put into the market given the fact we needed to ramp up production um, coming off of a, a, ten, a kind of a slowish year in 2019. But uh, yeah, it was a remarkable year. And we know there's, there's, there's even bigger demand this year since a lot of consumers didn't get what they wanted in 2020. Your most popular cart is the Model 4, which debuted in 2020 and has all the upgrades. Really everything Click Gear has to offer in that cart. Yeah, it was introduced early last year, right before the pandemic hit. So it's still a fresh, clean, new model. It's just one year in. And yeah, a couple of nice upgrades to it. New bag straps, a little bit more uh, intuitive, user-friendly, a little more durable than the previous bag straps. And the ability for the upper saddle and the cart to be adjusted, the upper bag straps to be adjusted up and down which is a really nice feature a lot of juniors like for smaller golf bags. And that feature also allows the bag to be a little more upright on the cart, which some people like that feature as well. Well, let's start with the fact that it folds to a compact size, making transportation to and from the course a lot easier. Absolutely, yeah. That feature is, has been a mainstay with Click Here from day one. That's kind of been our calling card. And this card is just as compact as it always has been, just as lightweight as it always has been. The, the weight and the, and the size have not changed. So yeah, the, the compact feature and the ability to travel easily is still a really nice upgrade for us. One of the most important aspects to having your own card is what I would term a glove compartment or storage areas, because you need to be able to get to your accessories throughout the round. We call it a console. And ours has always had a, a locking lid on it, which is nice, keeps things secure in there. And it's large. You can put golf balls, your phone, your range finder, a sandwich, all kinds of nice stuff in it. Plus the storage net that's uh, positioned right below the console gives you extra storage room for a, a rain cover, uh, a rain jacket, all kinds of other additional things. Uh, the other neat thing about Click Gear is uh, unlike a lot of our competitors, we do have a really wide range of accessories. That still comes into play with the 4.0. All the same accessories line up really nicely with the product, whether the accessory fits on the handle of the cart, which many of them do, or they fit on the frame of the cart someplace. All of the accessories work in conjunction with the 4.0 new model. No change there. Of course, people can find those at their local golf shop. If folks want to learn more about the Model 4 or anything from Click Gear, where should they go? They should go to clickyourusa.com. Historically, um, you would find all of our products available on that website. And today you can find replacement parts, you can find accessories, you can find a dealer locate if you want to go locally and try to find the product locally. 
And hopefully once we get ahead of this demand curve, we can start having carts available on, on that website as well, Ralph. <laughs> Todd, thanks for taking the time to join us. Yeah, thanks for having me. Appreciate it. I want to thank Todd Hansen for joining us here on the Golf Spotlight. Looking to carry instead? Check out our look at the latest carry and hybrid bags from Titleist. Once again, please click that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so you never miss one of our exclusive features. Have questions? Leave a comment down below. We always reply. Follow us on Twitter at Golf Spotlight. Get the latest from us on Instagram at The Golf Spotlight. And listen to the Range Podcast where we hear the stories behind some of the great equipment innovations from over the years. Finally, we want to thank you for joining us here on the Golf Spotlight as we continue to give you the information that you need for your next golf purchase.